The U.S. corn harvest is the Super Bowl of farming. The sheer scale of it is staggering. We don't want a day drain, that's for sure. Corn farms can be as large as 2,000 acres or bigger, and so that's about the size of 20 Vatican cities. But it's not just the size. At stake with every harvest are billions of dollars and potentially millions of lives. The challenge? To pick the more than 68 million acres of the U.S. dent corn crop. So how do farmers do it? Not by hand, that's for sure. Instead, they call in their secret weapon, a monster machine called a combine. During the harvest season, when time is limited, we need to get our crops off in a hurry. It takes around 120 to 200 man hours to harvest one hectare of field corn by hand, whereas a combine can perform a, an equivalent amount of work anywhere from a half to just over an hour. A top-of-the-line model like this can cost as much as $400,000. It can also cut, shuck, and shell more than 200 acres a day. Oh, that's a six-cylinder John Deere diesel, and it, it's like 120 horsepower. It's got a turbocharger on it, the engine housed. An entire farm's profits rest on the combine's ability to perform. And the tool taking the biggest bite is called the header. The corn comes in four rows at a time through the head. It's picked up by the gathering chains, and then the snapping rolls snap the ear of corn off the stalk. But the combine doesn't just cut the ears. Its powerful machinery can turn a stalk of corn into a blast of golden kernels in seconds. The ears slam into a rotating drum that shakes the kernels from the cob. An auger then lifts the loose kernels into a hopper for shipping. Every truckload is gold. With corn prices at record highs, each acre harvested can be worth $1,000.